this Diwali will help us understand what it is we truly need to do in our lives. We've been cleaning our homes to invoke Sri Lakshmi, but this year we'll clean out our hearts so that our hearts are filled with compassion, not just for our nearest and dearest, but for everyone. This year, what we will do is to make sure that we light the lamp of care for every single human being, but even all the living creatures of the earth and even nature itself. But also, most of all, our hearts are filled with gratitude, a feeling of deep appreciation and thanks for what the Creator has blessed us with and the things that we can share with each other. So I know that Diwali will be different, but yet it will be very, very special. And really, truly, my vision is that there is a future world of light that we are moving towards. And the collective energy of all of us igniting this lamp inside ourselves is going to make sure that that light is able to reach out everywhere. I know that as we walk in the light, as we ourselves experience that light, we're sharing that light with everyone we come across. And so this is why Diwali is truly a universal festival. Diwali, a festival of lights, living lights, sparking lights, radiating lights. Let us celebrate together. This is special Diwali at a special time where we are able to dispel the darkness of fear, tension, worry. When inner light is lit, then it's 100% sure and when surety and security is there, fear, despair doesn't exist anymore. Then it is a real festival. Festival means celebration and celebration means liberation, victory. Our, our own inner insecurities, weakness and vices. So let us celebrate and eat together real sweet which you can put inside of that is love for yourself, love for selfless love for others and love for the Supreme Diva, the Supreme Light. And let us earn the wealth of contentment, the wealth which we earn and bring contentment and heart is happy. Angels don't walk, they always fly Travel first class beyond the sky Angels don't walk, no they don't walk They prefer to fly What's with the burden you carry round He's come to take the worry from your mind How will you lift off and fly on home if you're all way down. Angels don't walk, they always fly. Travel first class beyond the sky. Angels don't walk, no they don't walk, they prefer to fly. A very big and loving happy Diwali to everyone this year. Diwali has now become a festival of the world and wherever you live in the world Diwali is being celebrated. So I'm sending you lots of love and good wishes from Australia. So how are you going to celebrate Diwali this year? For me I think the way to celebrate this year is to spread the light of love and good wishes for everyone. It's a challenging world and if we just bring a little light into someone's life, that is a huge gift for Diwali. So may you have a wonderful Diwali. 
and lots and lots of love and greetings from Sydney and all of Australia. Thank you. Greetings for Diwali. A very, very happy Diwali to all of you. It will be a unique Diwali. We are not doing what we usually do, shopping, partying, and meeting as many people as we can, eating. But what we will be doing is connecting with a feeling of hope and love and sharing our light, our really true inner light with each other, spreading that light of hope and love around the world. But especially today, I want to give my good wishes to my brothers and sisters in India. Greetings from Australia. Om Shanti. Deepavali symbolizes the victory of good over evil, victory of knowledge over ignorance. Preparation for celebration of Deepavali begins quite earlier. People start to clean up their houses, buy new utensils, have new clothes. But the highlight of Deepavali is invocation of Goddess Lakshmi and also igniting the lights. Now, sometimes we wonder that how can we invoke Goddess Lakshmi who is so pure in a world in which we are living today is full of vices, full of ignorance in the form of darkness. In fact, what we need to do in order to celebrate the true Deepavali is to first of all clean our minds, make our mind into a temple so clean that we are able to invoke Goddess Lakshmi which means invoke the divinity from within ourselves and in order to invoke the divinity, the Goddess within ourselves we need to ignite the lamp. So, igniting the light on the day of Deepavali represents becoming aware of ourselves as a living light. Living light as soul within this body. So, when I am able to practice the awareness of the soul, that is by igniting light, I make my mind into a temple then I am able to invoke the Goddess, the Divinity within ourselves. (music) 
Diwali means happiness. Diwali means celebration. Diwali means newness. We wish you a very happy Diwali and may the light of the divine the light of the divine give you peace and happiness because where there is light there is peace and happiness so our wish for you is may you be very peaceful and happy in the coming years let the past be the past and we look forward we all of us we look forward together for a very beautiful future in the future we will pass through all these different difficult times that we are facing the corona virus and then the economic downfall and then the political situation and many others we hope that all of that will soon come to an end with this great celebration the celebration of bringing the light of the divine to this world so once again a very happy diwali to all my brothers and sisters all over the world may you be always happy selamat hari dipawali kepada semua umat hindu di seluruh dunia there comes a time when it appears The screen of life is fading Tales of glory jaded stories aimlessly replaying Some are true others not often time serene Stifle dreams of joyful scenes and what lies in between stage it's set and everyone the cast acting out and wondering why the good roles never last but stable and unshaken with courage in your heart the play has not yet ended we have a special part Happy Diwali Greetings of love, peace and happiness from Indonesia We all know that the significance of Diwali is a festival of light It's not just a festival of light It's hope for a brighter future It also indicates the victory of light over darkness. Especially at this point of time, let us light up the flame of hope to the world. I always remind myself not just light up the physical light, lamp, but be the living light, living lamp. living the park once again wishing my global family a very happy self diwali happy diwali the festival of light and so the celebration itself tells us a very deep message let us enlighten ourselves and rekindle others and destroy the darkness in the world and let us go into a world where there is enlightenment and day and brightness so i would take the inspiration from this diwali that let us bring hope encouragement enthusiasm and happiness health wealth 
in one's cell life and others. And let us have a united, happy world. This is the inspiration we will share with everyone this Diwali. Because 2020 actually put mankind in a huge darkness, but really that was also a realization. So let us have this celebration very positively. Happy Diwali! and loving blessings to you all from Australia. I'm Chrissy, and I'm wishing you all a blessed and joyous and fun-filled Diwali. What a beautiful time to be celebrating light, to be bringing light into this world and taking away the darkness of fear and uncertainty that is everywhere around us. So the light that shines from each one of you can clear away the darkness and overcome all forms of evil, the power of light. And as that light shines through the darkness, Lakshmi, Goddess Lakshmi will find you and come into all your homes, into the lives of your family and friends and bring you luck and success and love and blessings into the lives of all your family and friends and take you into a new year filled with possibilities, success and, and, and hope. Happy Diwali! It's a beautiful festival of light. When we recognize ourselves as a point of light, and connect with the divine light. Everything's possible. So in this beautiful festival, let us unite as a light and heal the world, give hope and spread the happiness. Happy Diwali.
Om Shanti. This is Brother Jonathan from Manila, Philippines. I'd like to greet our brothers and sisters all over India on the auspicious occasion of Diwali, the much-awaited uh, event of the year, the Festival of Lights. For me, the spiritual significance of Diwali is the uh, awakening of the inner light called Atma and uh, the emergence of the divine in us, so that India may also ignite the inner lights and awaken the, the, the kumbhakarnas of the world on their spiritual slumber. These are the uh, unprecedented times in the world where the world is in its darkest. So let the spiritual light of India spread to enlighten everyone. The world is waiting and is beckoning for this greatest task which only India can fulfill. So let's keep our light shining for nothing can dim the light that shines within. Om Shanti, Happy Diwali! As luzes são acesas, já chegou de Wali, trazendo alegria, amor e paz a nossos lares. Estrelas brilham em festa por todos os lugares. Celebre um novo dia, já chegou de Wali. A escuridão não vai voltar, vitória certa de chegar. A escuridão não vai voltar, vitória certa de chegar. Acenda a luz da alma que brilha. Hi, it's Lucky, and I just want to wish everyone a very, very happy Diwali. Everyone watching, everyone celebrating. Like Ram and Sita, everyone was shining their light, but also we can shine our inner light, the soul, the inner diva. So, how will I enlighten my inner self this Diwali? I reminded myself who I truly am. Hey yo, Diwali, the festival of light, bringing together all families and people. A deep message of hope, the moral of good, overcoming evil. So when times get hard, always have strength and courage. And God will always help and you will flourish. When you're feeling hurt, hungry, malnourished, God's power will heal, mend, encourage. Go inwards, then upwards and connect, then outwards and project. All the rays from the Supreme Soul, the Almighty, enlighten your inner self with love. This Diwali. Peace. Aki Seas. You believe in me? I know it's true. Everything I say, everything I do, cause I can't go wrong with you. Cause baby, you love what I do, and I don't need to try hard with you. Cause baby, you love. What I do You really help me Musically I hope I help you Feel the same way too Cause I can't go wrong With you, yeah Cause baby you love What I do festival of Diwali reminds us of the victory of good over evil, light over darkness, truth over falsehood. And we know that the human race is currently passing through a period of global darkness, spiritual darkness. So for me, Diwali especially is centered around the importance and the power of truth. Truth is beautiful. Truth is eternal. Truth requires no decoration, no protection, no projection. Truth needs no hype. And the truth of knowledge reminds us one of 
who we are spiritually, our true spiritual identity. Secondly, our eternal connection with the Supreme Light. And thirdly, the understanding of how life works, the law of cause and effect, action and reaction, choice and consequence, the law of karma. So to live within alignment of these three main truths is for me the true Diwali, which leads to freedom, and that freedom leads to real happiness. and greetings of happy Diwali from Korea. The significance of Diwali, Festival of Lights, is very deeply touching the hearts of Koreans. The famous Indian poet Rabindranath Tagore once wrote about Korea, In the golden age of Asia, Korea was one of the lamp bearers. And that lamp is waiting to be lighted once again for illumination of the East. We feel that uh, the uh, lamp that Tagore mentioned is really being ignited once again in the world, in the hearts of many souls who have been suffering and in sorrow. And we truly hope this Diwali will bring the lights uh, to the hearts of many souls uh, so that the golden age will uh, come here once again, not just for the East, but also for the entire world. Happy Diwali! Happy Diwali! Happy Diwali! Happy Diwali! Happy and joyful Diwali! Happy Diwali! Happy Diwali! Happy Diwali! Happy, happy Diwali! Tall branches are hanging off the edge Across the ground lay my hopes and dreams With my bare feet Holding my breath to unfold the mystery I'm waiting, I'm waiting for the sun to rise I'm waiting, I'm waiting to shine bright I want to stand tall like a pillar very glad to say right now to you and I would like to say a few words about Diwali celebration and probably everybody know that Diwali celebration it's about new beginning and you should leave your past in, in the past and move forward and probably two fundamental thoughts which I receive in my life. It's first, don't blame yourself. Accept yourself, yourself with all your history from the past. Accept us a perfect. Yes, it was a lot of mistakes, but it was correct mistakes. It is 
your dramaturgy of life. So don't blame yourself because you lose a lot of energy when you blame in yourself. Care about yourself, love yourself, respect yourself. It's very important. And second thought is that if we have honest desires, honest desires which go in, in agreement with God desires, it's very pure desires, then we will have motivation to make them true. So please be honest with yourself and ask yourself what you really need, what you really want. And then look to the God's eyes and told him. And if he will tell you that, that's beautiful desire, child. Green light, move forward. Then that's it. Happy Diwali!